What is happening here is three and here of time here presenting you with a whole new world. Actually, it's just HeroCraft season two, but a it is. I was world. hoping you would sing that when I said that. <laughs> it really is a whole new world. It You'll is. see what what we mean by that. You're already seeing some new names, new people, lots of deaths in the death thing. Uh, some 53 new for me. Uh, basically, a lot has been happening. Uh, I don't know, should we tell them what's happening now, or should we go up and talk to them about some of the server membership and things like that that has happened? Your choice, bruh. I think we'll get it out of the way first, just because it's weird. Alright, so, here's the deal. Y'all know MC Infinity, and on the server he had a brother on here, and he also had... Uh, there was a member of the server who was on before him, but they had become friends on the server. And as y'all know... I had MC Infinity being server manager because basically I'm really busy this semester, so it's hard to run this all myself uh, and do all this stuff. And Matt's pretty busy, so neither of us really have time for this stuff anymore. Yes. And uh, before I go on, it is laggy right now, but that's not entirely our fault. Minecraft is Mojang is currently having internal server issues, so uh, basically lots of servers are are pretty laggy and pretty bad with connection right now. Anyway. So what happened was, when we had originally set the server up, uh, MC Infinity, I had just made him server manager when we restarted, and I told him, you know, I was going to be gone, not really gone for a few days, but I was going to be extremely busy with coming back to school and, and all that stuff, uh, and college is pretty hectic and crazy, and uh, so I told him I needed him to get the world set up, you know, get the spawn center made, get the hub made, and so uh, I let him do that, and... Uh, Basically, he made a whole bunch of fake stuff with creative mode. <laughs> world edit. Uh, if you guys don't know, we, we are a vanilla server, but we're on Bucket just because I like Bucket more. And Bucket works a lot better than vanilla. If you know anything about server managing, you know that Bucket basically it has their gig together way more than Mojang. So it's cleaner, it runs faster, it takes up less memory. It's just altogether better. And so... While I had him setting it up, he asked me to put on World Edit, and I was reluctant, but I said, okay, I'm throwing a lot on you, I'll give you World Edit. Now, I thought when, that he would use World Edit for some some clearing out some grass, or, you know, some, some small stuff, not building whole structures. But if you go back to the first nine episodes, you'll probably see us in the hub or the spawn center at times, and you'll notice that it's, it's pretty stinking fake looking, and that's because it is. He just used slash sphere hollow and made yeah, the that's whole hollow. because it was. Yeah, it looks fake because it, 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 it was fake. And, you know, that's all fine and well because I didn't have time to make it myself, so I couldn't really judge him for not making it. But um, what basically had happened is we told him enough of that, and then uh, last year, yeah. We told him enough of that, and then he was using... So we, we had gotten rid of World Edit and stuff uh, by that point. But we had gotten rid of game mode, and um, uh, well, we had told him to stop using game mode, because he was opt, because he's server manager. We told him to stop using game mode, and he was TPing his brother and his friend a lot, and we told him to stop using slash TP, and he wouldn't. So so basically, we, we had to really keep cracking down on him about it, telling him not to use it. And and finally, we just we had to de-op him for a little while, but then we, we re opt him, and... Uh, I guess he decided to build uh, iron farm at spawn, and it's basically this iron farm that produces a uh, thousand plus iron a minute. And now I know why he's building at a spawn. The iron farm, for it to work correctly, needs to always be in loaded chunks, and the all only chunks that are always loaded are spawn. Uh, but the thing is, he was building it in creative, and either way, I wouldn't have appreciated him building it just because it was an eyesore. And having an iron farm like that makes the game too easy, and it's really stupid in my opinion. So, uh, he was building it out of red dyed hardened clay and, like, quartz. And he literally had, like, 10,000 blocks of quartz in it. So it would have been one thing if he made it in creative mode with, like, not obviously cheated stuff. But it was so obviously cheated. And besides that, doing that thing in creative mode is stupid anyway, because it's already a cheap thing to make. Like, not cheap, like, easy to make, but it's, like... Cheating to make that sort of thing. And to cheat, to cheat, is kind of lame. So, we told him that he had to tear it down. Uh, but he, So he got mad, and uh, we tore it down for him. 
<laughs> and then we, we told him he had to be demoted. He couldn't really do that position anymore. But but we were going to put him back in the position uh, after we could tell he was calmed down and stuff. And we're just going to take away some responsibility from him because too much power. You know, he went power, him, power man. Uh, basically, when we did that, keep inventory was turned on. Uh, Matt and I decided to change our vote and turn keep inventory off because we decided it's worse for the YouTubing and it's just less fun. And the main thing is in the console, people were slash killing to go home and to get home and to get out of places and they were really abusing it. So we just decided to get rid of it. And we got a few people. The vote was basically tied. It was like five people saying yes, one person saying no, and everybody else saying I don't know. So when me and Matt said no, it was officially tied. And I tell you guys, but this being my server, my vote is the swing vote. <laughs> so, and MC edit or MC Infinity, when we uh, had, uh, I was just showing Matt MC edit on another world guess. I was showing him. Well, I can't tell you because it's actually secret. preparation for something we're going to be making on this world later. But secrets, guys, secrets. Um, MC Infinity, uh, he was mad about that, and he said that his vote should count. For the most, him, his brothers, and his friend, who are the three yeses, said their vote should count the most because they play more than anybody. And I'm like, no, I'm the owner, so my vote is kind of the only one that actually matters. Uh, not that that's completely true, but my word is the final word. Um, not to be unfair, but I'm paying for the server. So that's just how it is, guys. So we we went through that with him, and then the next day he had blown up hub, blown up spawn, and burnt down our, our beginning of our treehouse. Uh, the ironic part of that is that he built Spawn and Hub, so he just wasted his own time. I want you to hear that, MC Infinity, because I know you're watching this video because you're stalking all of our members and watching all their videos like a big creeper. I want you to hear that you wasted your own freaking time, you idiot. And uh, <laughs> besides that, his brother also got on the next day, and I went ahead and removed both of them from the server. And I was having, I was believing in them, and I was making a move of good faith by keeping them on. And then... Uh, his brother said, no, I don't want to be unwhitelisted. I, I wasn't. I tried to tell him to stop. I was like, okay, I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. Sure enough, the next day he does it all again, so I remove him. And then the next day, uh, their other friend uh, did it again, so I had to remove him. The irony of all, all of it is, one, yes, they built all, uh, all the spawn and hub, so it was kind of pointless for them to do that. You wasted your time, you guys are idiots. And the other point, the other ironic thing is that our... I back up the server every day. So every time they did that, it literally took me five seconds to restore the server. And when we were having that meltdown, I had sort of told the members, don't get on, don't do anything important, because stuff's fixing to go down. So they wasted their own time. So we got rid of them, and uh, we've re-energized our server. Uh, we got new people, as you can see. We actually have a ton of new people, which we're going to show you their doorways later. Six. But for now, we have six... 18, 18 oh, people yeah. on the server now. We have 18 people on the server now. And uh, I don't know how many are new. I can't remember. I think we have like 14 new people. But so the first thing we did is destroyed spawn. And uh, so this is the new spawn city. So we decided, my girlfriend said if we got rid of everything, she would do the building for our server. So she's officially server manager. And she built this wonderful thing. These chandeliers, everybody's loving them. Uh, where we were down there is actually something we're working on right now for events in the future, and you'll, you'll see that in upcoming episodes. Uh, these are the rules. Uh, we don't really need to know the rules because I know the rules because I made the rules. Um, but uh, you know what? If you want to know them, there they are. Pause the video. You can see them. There those are. Uh, pause the video and you can see them. There those are. Pause the video. All right. So basically, this is this is all 100% legit. Nothing in here is creative moded anymore. This is all survival mode. All right, we've made this all. Some of the server members have helped us, but uh, we've made it all legit. And then another thing that people have been wanting on the server is a spawn village. Now, uh, I had never been behind this server because, as you can know from our jolly old Americans' name, jolly old Americans' name, our inspiration is the jolly old Brits, right, Matt? Yes. That's actually how me and Matt met, was trying to make a server like XRPMX 13's GLG Craft. That was long before either of us planned to YouTube. Yeah, way. I think, right? Oh, way, but way before that. Yeah. yeah, a couple of days for you, a couple months for me. That's way before, I guess. And uh, <laughs> so basically, we did that. And then, now, I had never watched Mindcrack. 
but I have recently uh, fallen in love, you could say, with vintage beef. And now, the thing Shout is that out. before I had started watching them, uh, when we made this new server, the members had been telling me they wanted to start making a spawn village. And I was like, okay, that's cool. And then we kicked off three of the members that said they wanted to do that. <laughs> and then we made the spawn village. And after making the spawn village, I actually started watching uh, Vintage Beef. And in this, I realized that, hey, I've actually kind of made a server incidentally similar to Minecraft. And I will honestly tell you, I did not know Minecraft before then. Because they told me spawn village, and each time they told me it, I literally said, okay, tell me again what you mean by a spawn village. Matt had to explain that to me like 20 times. Yep. It was sad. So, we have inadvertently created our own Minecraft server, but we would like to think it's better because Minecraft is unorganized, and we are very organized. All right. So, Matt, <sighs> Matt hasn't seen out. a lot of this either because he has been gone in Houston this weekend. So, lots of, yes. and lots of members in there, too. Now, I can't see this, show you the super secret project because you can't look up, and you, if you look up, you get yelled at. Um, I don't know why those are there. Oh, stop. Broke the carpet. Oh. Alright, I'll break those doors later. Alright, so we have the spawn village. Uh, we have, these are where people are reserving their shops. Yeah. These are where uh, we're collecting stuff for the super secret project. This is where they're making a map of the spawn village. A few of the members have decided that our server hey. goal is to make a world map that encompasses everyone's home. So it just it has to reach everyone's home. That would be hard. Like, really hard. Like, ridiculous. And uh, so there's more. Uh, we'll go to the first home, the first shop, uh, Jessica's again, Koala Bear, you saw her on the Wither special, killing it with me. Uh, this is her shop, there. her shop is the template, and this is what all shops are sort of supposed to be crafted after, it's a flower shop, it's pretty nice. She's had some customers, Matt. Really? Although she had a tulip thief, thief problem, but it was her tulips that are outside, I had to crack skulls. <laughs> and somebody came in with a horse, so she had to put a please tie your horse here before entering. Alright, so there's a few more. Well, actually, there's a lot more now. There uh, is, like, so much. Here's Fluffy's Supermarket. Uh, you buy groceries there. We're not gonna... I guess we, we won't really walk around and show you every store just because that'll take us forever. Time crunch. If you want to see them all again, then we'll show you. Uh, here is a mob drop shop. Over here is PQ's Place. Uh, he's hardware. gonna sell. It's a hardware store. He's gonna sell like dirt blocks and cobblestone and all those uh, uh, no, things think... that you don't think about. So uh, <laughs> out here, JD, what JDB, Jeff, also Jeff. Jeff it, look for his uh, descript uh, link in the description below. By the way, all these new people uh, are YouTubing on here, and their links will be in the description below from now on. Yep. Uh, this is a mortal legend who is an old member. He is making a horse shop. He's not a YouTuber, just so you know. But he is an old member, and he is very loyal. He's the OG. Uh, this one I haven't seen. I just saw this now. I think this is this is High Kevin 123's shop. I have not even noticed this one. I saw this one. Yeah, I think this is Kevin's. He's selling, like, building... I feel like this is what... Uh, what? PQ is doing, maybe. No. What is PQ doing? PQ has like wooden axes. Oh, he has tools axes. and stuff. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, this is Ellie's uh, statue and nether shop. We'll definitely be buying uh, order or getting an order from him at some point. Over here is Immortal Legend. Who? Or no, Proctor. Oh, wait. Link Proctor. in the description below once again. His uh, ore shop. He sells the ore for a reasonable price. This is Jilly from Singapore, guys. We have. Uh, become culturally diverse. We have lots of internationality in our blood. Ellie now. from Europe. Her potion shop over there. Yeah, Ellie is from uh, Denmark, I believe. I don't know. Proctor, I believe, is is UK. I want to say. Yeah. Wait. Yeah, he is. Yeah. And uh, we got two other. Jill is Singapore. We got Ellie in Denmark. Proctor is from UK. We got a Netherlander, and then we have. Another UK one, I think. Oh, remember the other UK one. And then out here is something 
construction okay. shop is what that is. But then over here is an enchantment store. I've actually bought a lot of stuff from here already because they're at good prices. And uh, Band of Anthropods for yeah, she's basically just selling enchantments. Yeah, yeah, look like at these. these, man. These are good stuff right here. These are special handmade books. Holy cow! That will be back here soon. <laughs> All right, and then there's one more shop in development. Don't look up on that roof, guys. You're not allowed to look up there. Uh, this is mine and Matt's shop to come. I don't know, Matt. You want to say what it is? Uh, um, or not? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yes. This is going to be a. What's it called again? Dang it. Bacon. Bacon. It's a ba bacon. Mm -hmm. Beacon shop. This is our beacon shop. Matt and Caleb's. We're gonna shop. hunt down wither skulls for people. We're going to kill the wither for them. Except it won't be like the special. We'll actually set it up to where it'll be easy to kill. It's and we're gonna make a sick shop. And you'll see what the design for the shop will be in a few episodes, I'm sure. And we're gonna collect the iron box for you. And we're gonna sell it for a high roller price. It's not gonna be cheap. Uh, yeah. We're thinking multiple diamond blocks, so the shop is for the high rollers. So that's that's the spawn village, guys. And uh, so kind of the deal is, this is the work we've done. There's a few things planned still to uh, add something to the roof of the spawn center. Uh, hopefully you can already tell what it is from the few glances we've had up there. Um, we're also going to completely reset the nether because... We'll go in there and show you one more time. The hub is completely uh, different. No, not completely different. It's completely world edited. This is a piece of crap, guys. This sucks. And we're going to get rid of it. And we're going to remake it. And uh, so that's going to happen. And rather than blow it all up or tear it all down, which we're going to do, slowly members have been showing me stuff that apparently uh, MC Infinity came into the world and edited like while I was gone into the nether as well so we're finding all kinds of stuff he did so it's just going to be easier to reset the nether i think what we're going to actually do is one day come in here and maybe like not legit i will spawn the wither in here and we'll just have a fun time Yay. and then we'll just pretend like it never happened i think that'll be fun because yeah. everybody's saying we should use the wither to blow up the nether i think that'd be a good idea all right so let's go over who's on the server hungry dollar not a youtuber also, it's not a sin not to be a YouTuber on here, guys. It's just when we were, we redesigned our mission statement to more suit YouTubers, that's what we decided. Hi, Hi Kevin is a YouTuber. Jilly from Singapore, a YouTuber. JDP, JDB, also known as Jeff, he is a YouTuber as well. Spotted uh, Shark. Crazy Doc and Dynamo F for the win are both YouTubers and Twitchers. Fluffy, Fuzzy, and Minnie are very active members. You see Fluffy is on. Fuzzy just went to bed. Uh, they're all three YouTubers. Minnie is not YouTubing on here so far, though. Me and Matt, uh, we're not YouTubers. We just play. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Elias from Denmark. He's an old member, but he is also uh, recording now. Uh, Caleb PQ, who lives yeah. literally 20 minutes from me, apparently, <laughs> is, is uh, YouTubing as well. Um, let's see, he's Koala Bear is not YouTubing, but she's our server manager. Yeah, there he is, he's on. Alrighty, and then we have Proctor08, who is UK. He's recording. Immortal Legend, uh, who is a tried and true member from the old days. He's actually a pretty old member. He's probably our server elder now, isn't he? I'm not sure when he joined. He joined pretty long ago. He used to not play either, though. And he plays a lot now, dude. Ellie, shout out to you. You're a champ. I believe in you. Alright? You let me know if you need a diamond or something sometime. I got yeah. it to you. Check out my stash, guys. I've been working. Guys, Check this is the mine. longest I've gone between recordings. And I, <laughs> We've done a lot. I don't know if Matt's done a lot. Because he's been busy lately. But I've been playing. And I know before we didn't do anything off camera in first season... But I decided to change my outlook on it. Now, personally, I'm not doing anything to my home. But I will collect some resources. I will make weapons. These are actually uh, some pretty awesome things. My wither fighting weapons all uh, all healed up. And uh, 
They're good. I have my wither fighting armor on. I didn't heal it up, but this stuff's all healed up. Uh, this the sword and the the bow that is. I already had the pickaxe. Uh, yeah, I got. I'm waiting to use the pickaxe on uh, a mining trip or glowstone, one or the other. Uh, I actually wanted looting, but I didn't get or uh, fortune. So this is pretty much it. We're gonna tear down the hub soon. Reset the Nether. And here's the deal. We're gonna go wander onto our home, but. Uh, you guys remember, uh, we, oh, you don't remember this. Well, one night, we decided to blow up Proctor's home. Yeah, because we didn't show them. We didn't remember us. Yeah, we didn't record it or, like, show them or anything. Huh. Yeah. We just went to this place, we built a sandcastle, and put a door with a button, and Proctor, being the fool that he is, he pressed that button and blew his pad up. It was in front of his house, but it was like 16D, and it made like a humongous hole, guys. <laughs> so we felt so bad that we we patched that up right there. But then he got us back, apparently. And I've seen his prank, unfortunately, and I wasn't recording. However, I got on today, and Fuzzy told me not to go to my home unless I was recording. So I can only imagine what that means. So well, let's let's wander on home, Matt, because it's been a while since I've been there. I have done a little work there, but not since Fuzzy messaged me today. Well, actually, I think she messaged me yesterday. But, uh, we haven't also, done any work on our house. Yeah, we haven't done any work on our house. I have made a farm by our house, just a temporary one, but that's about it. This is actually my wither farm down here where I work on killing withers. It's pretty, pretty legit. Alright, you ready to go in, dude? I didn't even know you had that. Dude, that's what I've been doing. I've been getting wither... I've gotten two wither skulls since you guys... I'll show you guys real quick. Whoa, 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 right whoa. What's going on? Yeah. They What's definitely on? did something. What the... Hey, I, can I get out here? Is this lava or is it glass? Okay. It's kind of hard to tell the glass now, guys. Because it's... one of Proctor's pranks was replacing Oops. our... Uh, purple glass with what he called, uh... Piss glass? Yeah, urine-colored glass. It's green <laughs> glass, apparently. So, uh, I watched this video where he did it, and he basically said he was wanting to mess with my OCD. And I, I'm here to tell you, Proctor, congratulations, because you're a champ. Uh, but Proctor, in doing so, has initiated the prank wars on our server. And, uh, that's sort of just what's going to go down here. Uh, let's go show you guys what else he did. Uh, this we'll oh, put yeah. his video or his channel will be in the description, so you can you can find the pranks. Uh, he didn't actually do this in the video. I guess he came back to do it. But the other day, I came down here to mine for some coal and some iron. And that was like a week or two ago. It's been a long time since we recorded. Yeah, because um, we bulk recorded that one time. Yeah. We literally recorded like seven episodes in one sitting. And what did we decide, like Matt? That we're not going to do that anymore. We're not oh. going to do that anymore because we did that and two weeks later a lot has changed on the freaking server. And also yes. we're going to start recording maybe one or two episodes in a sitting. Unless like like I'm going to Africa in March. We'll record that week's worth in advance. But okay. we're not going to do that anymore so that nothing happens big in between. So that you guys can be filled in sooner. We don't want to do that anymore. And also we decided we're going to start editing more. Because yep. we spent... Nine episodes on two thing, two projects, <laughs> and we should have spent maybe four on those two projects. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start editing, and we'll start and we'll show you a lot. And I think we're not sure if we'll quit recording or if we'll keep recording and then just decide later what to keep in. But we'll decide. I don't think we'll have anything like that this episode. So one thing that uh, Proctor did was come down here, take all our steps, and put them. On the ceiling, which on the video he gets tired of doing it at this point and then just <laughs> runs up the rest of them. But I had come down here to get iron the other day and I didn't even notice that this wasn't the stairs weren't here until I was about here. And I was like, man, this getting up here is quite late, laborious. And I'm like, we had to have put steps in here. And then I look up and I'm like, dude, <laughs> this server has a glitch or something because this is not natural. So I'm like thinking, our server's screwed, man. Stuff is happening. It's weird. We have glitches. There's blocks Steps on the ceiling. Steps on the roof. Steps on the roof. I mean, I had already seen the obsidian thing, and I thought that that was 
I knew that was a prank. I just I just figured that was it. And bear in mind, at this point, uh, the new people are on Fluffy Fuzzy and them were already on. And Caleb PQ, I don't, I think we only had like four new members at that point. And mm-hmm. uh, they had told me that he pranked me, so I thought that this was the prank, right? Lame prank. Apparently this is our obsidian, so thanks a lot for that. That'll be fun to pick up. Uh, but then I come out here and I'm like, hey, we have green glass. That's a glitch too. Oh my gosh, Minecraft's going crazy. And then they're like, no, dude. No, okay, I'll be an idiot. They're like, Proctor pranked you, bro. And I'm like, oh. That sucks. <laughs> so I guess this is this is their prank. Is yeah. this your prank? I think it is. Yeah. Oh, oh, Fuzzy's not on. Fluffy's the only one on, I guess. I don't know if Fluffy did it or not. Uh, this did is the temporary cow farm. There? Huh? Did you put that wood up there? No. Did... Did we not have that wood to begin with? Uh, uh, I don't think so. <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> okay, well, here is a cow farm. The reason I put this up, that there may have been two done the same day. Oh, Another man. one done? Oh, no. Why is everybody pranking us, man? <laughs> oh. Okay, so we have the the reason I have this cow farm is Proctor sells sixteen iron for thirty two s- cooked steak, but oh, he yeah. sells he sells like a few diamonds for half a stack of iron, so that means that a full stack of beef will buy you a few diamonds. So we have a beef farm <laughs> to take advantage of that. Who uh, did this? Who did the sand wall? Uh, Thing it was fuzzy, maybe. No, she just said her and Fuzzy did a different one. What? Well, put a sign on your pranks, guys. Uh, if you're watching this right now, put a freaking sign on your prank. All right. Okay. It's all right. Okay. I'm taking you it just down, t- master. Okay. Look I also made a temporary farm because food drains so ridiculous on Minecraft now. And the reason right. I made it actually was to reproduce my cows, but uh, then I just got the ball rolling and I kept going. Food drains so ridiculous. I hope in 1.8 that uh, that dinner bone fixes that because it's annoying. I kind of want to go out to our home and remind them what it looks like. So you want to you want to just cut and go to our home? Uh, yes, sure. All right, we're gonna clear this out of the way, the sand, and then when we come back, we will be at our treehouse. Okay. Alrighty, guys. All right, so I guess we cut out. We said we weren't gonna cut out, but I guess that's okay. But uh, I guess we'll just we'll just Whoa. cut back in eventually. Whoa, what is whoa, it? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't see anything. You don't see that? No. What do you see? There's water on the on what? the tree. Do you not see it? Oh my gosh. Holy what crap. What the freaking heck? What? Who? So first the... <laughs> Dang. What the heck? <laughs> what is this all about? Did they just water our whole house? They watered our whole, like, island. What'd they do that for? It well, that's no like, fun. <laughs> they probably like messed up. Proctor. Hopefully. I don't know who this was. This must be their prank, dude, because they, they said they pranked us, and then they said the sand wasn't done. But maybe it's not. The sand was pretty stupid. Yeah. Is it them? <laughs> do you see it? What? There's a sign here. Oh, oh look, and it doesn't even fall. Oh, what? Whoa. They covered up our elevator. With... Seems oh. you have... A what situation, Fuzzy? Okay, they covered up our thing with obsidian. I hope they didn't do that all the way up, because... Oh. That elevator <laughs> took us days to make for granted. Uh, days in your guys' world, I guess. Yes. Uh, I'm going up the water slide. Oh, uh, all right. We're gonna have to get them back, man. It's prank back time. I mean, we started the pranks with Proctor, but we're gonna go ahead and get him back anyway. But we did nothing to these people. <laughs> what, dude? I, dude, I'm about to. Dang. We use the sand that whoever gave to us and clear out this water. All right, guys. Well, this this prank sucks. Um, Pretty much. I'm not even gonna give him props for it. <laughs> Don't uh, give him. No props given. I mean, very original, uh, I mean, uh, bravo, 
I, mean, I hate water. Cue slow clap. <laughs> I am being sarcastic, guys, just so you know. Very not creative. Hey, let's go stick some water on their house. So oh, they, they did cover the whole... Quit the recording. And that when they place a block <laughs> of sand, it doesn't fix it because they place water on freaking every block. Alright, well that's cool. They covered the whole elevator. I think so. Alright guys, well, I think we're done now. Yeah. Are you done? I'm done. Alright, well, I guess next episode we'll be getting them back because this is a sucky and prank. This and will probably be clean up. So, the episode was pretty long, but we had lots to talk about. We were hoping to respond to the pranks that we were promised we would see, but now that we know how crappy the pranks are, I think we're going to do a better comeback prank than I was thinking originally, because yeah. this prank sucks, so we're going to prank them pretty hard and show them what a real prank is, rather than doing... I was thinking, like, something small, like putting some pressure plates around their house to make them nervous. Yeah. But it's on, guys. So, I think the next episode will be pranking. Well, Definitely. But this episode is long. Do apologize for that. Uh, we tried to edit something out, but now I don't know how much of that walk we're going to edit out. Mm. Probably not any of it. <laughs> Maybe a little bit. We'll see. All right. You want to take us out, Matt? All right. <sighs> well, make sure to like if you enjoyed this extra long video. And if you do enjoy long videos, tell us. Because we will try to do more long videos. We actually try to keep it short. This one, we just had to talk about some stuff. But yeah, anyways, make sure to check out everybody's channel in the description. And yeah. We'll see you later. Bye. <laughs>